Welcome to the PERT installation video. Let's see how you can install a 4 node module. Inside you will find the PERT module, two fan regulators. Depending on the regulator you have, you can use the large regulator or the small one. In the box, you will also have the instruction manual and a warranty card for one year against any manufacturing defects. Identify four loads you would like to control. Switch off the MCB. Unscrew the switchboard. Study the wiring. The wire that connects all the switches is connected to live. Individual wires connected to the switches are connected to the loads. Identify the neutral in your switchboard, which is usually black. Unscrew the load wires and connect them to the terminals on your module. Connect live and neutral to the module. Connect the switches to a common wire isolated from any external supply. Connect the black wire of the signal cable to your first switch, brown to your second, and follow the sequence mentioned in the manual. In the four node module, yellow is the common for all the four loads. Make space for the module by adjusting the wires to a corner and insert the module. Screw the switchboard back in place. How to connect to the big fan regulator. Remove the load wire of the fan and connect to the first terminal of the PERT. Open the fan regulator, remove the knob, open the case, remove the existing PCB, remove the jumper connected to the fan regulator cable and connect it to the three pins on the regulator. Unscrew the fastener and tighten on the regulator casing. Fix the knob and close the casing. Fit it on your switchboard and close the board. How to connect to the small fan regulator? Remove the load wire of the fan and connect to the first terminal of the PERT. Open the fan regulator, remove the knob, open the case, remove the existing PCB, remove the jumper connected to the fan regulator cable and connect it to the three pins on the regulator. Unscrew the fastener and tighten on the regulator casing. Fix the knob and close the casing. Fit it on your switchboard and close the board. If you are not using the manual fan regulator, do not remove the jumper connected to the regulator cable. Switch on the MCB. Switch on the switches and check if your lights are working. If you are using an iPhone, open the PERT app. In the devices screen, press the plus button on the top right and select setup device. Select the type of device you are configuring. Toggle any switch connected to your device seven times until you hear a beep. Go to your phone's Wi-Fi settings and connect to the Wi-Fi source named PERT with a numerical unique identifier. The password is 12345678. Come back to the PERT app and click Next. Choose a router from the discovered list or enter the SSID manually. Select Security Type, enter your router's Wi-Fi password and press Connect. Connect your phone to your router and click Refresh on your app. Your app will discover an unconfigured device. Give your device a name and a private access passkey. Select the switches you would like to dim. Set the power cost per unit in your area. Click Save. Open your device and start controlling. If you're using an Android device, open the PERT app. In the Devices screen, press the plus button on the top right and select Setup Device. Select the type of device you are configuring. Toggle any switch connected to your device seven times until you hear a beep. Click Next. Make sure the router you want to connect to has a signal strength of more than 75%. Choose a router 
to pair with your device. Enter the password to your router and press done. Give your device a name. Your device will automatically be discovered. And choose whether you would like anyone to access your device on your Wi-Fi network. And click next. Open your device and start controlling. Have a good day.